Hello Pisces, getting ready to do your reading. All right, so we're going to see what is going on for you at this time. We ask for messages for Pisces. All right, overall energy is the king of coins. So some of you could be dealing with an earth sign, a businessman, businesswoman. We have the five of swords. How they view you, the eight of cups. Action advice need to know is the knight of swords and the outcome is the magician. Under the deck is justice, interesting. So somebody is seeing you as walking away or leaving the past. Oh, well, look where I spit the deck. I have to show you. It's the sun and the lovers. Beautiful energy. So this could be the beginning of a new relationship. But who is the king of coins? We have the five of wands, the six of wands, and the nine of coins. So whoever you're dealing with, it looks like... This person might like to argue. This person might like to always be right. This might be a work relationship for some of you. Um, because the five of swords in their energy is like somebody who has to win at all cost. So this is not good, but let me see five of swords. We have the king of wands, the three of wands, and the, wow, hello. So you may have new energy coming in the page of wands. Okay. The king of coins may be replaced by somebody else. Just, just saying. You may have someone who's much more sweet, more romantic coming in. There could be more than one person around you, Pisces, right now, but let me see. What is going on here? What is the, or, let me just also say this. This person may be toning down. They may be seeing that how they treat people, how they treated you was not nice. And there may be some payback or some karma, not necessarily from you, Pisces, but just that's what I'm seeing. It's like, they're kind of changing here. If this is all the same person, but let me see, what is the Eight of Cups? Because they view you as the Eight of Cups. Eight of Swords, Magician, and the Queen of Cups. Five of Swords. I don't think this person ever thought you'd walk away or you would actually leave. I'm sorry, I have to switch the way I'm sitting. Because um, it's kind of like someone who always thinks they're right. And then when you kind of ignore them, they kind of go into that King of Wands, Queen of Wands energy of flirting and trying to get your attention. And then when you actually, you did walk away, now they're kind of feeling emotional about the situation. It could be a situation where you never thought you would leave or you just uh, gave it a lot of your energy, but now you are walking away, but now they want to manifest you back. Okay? Because they're stuck on you they want to bring you back so what is being hidden what you need to know is the knight of swords energy what is this knight of swords energy we have the knight of wands the ace of swords and the ten of cups so no this person wants to come back in they want to renew this with you but what is the outcome of magician we have the sun card the seven of wands the hierophant Yeah, so somebody clearly wants another chance with you, Pisces. I don't know how you're feeling about this person. Um, we're going to have to do a little bit more. Let me see what this person wants to say to you. So I feel like they may have been very hurtful towards you. I can't stop thinking about you. I remember every detail of that day. And sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Hmm. Okay. Tell me something else about this connection. Oh, something just popped out. I have the sword and rose. So clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, force, honor, protection, and power. And that says the swords to me. So this is someone who wants to come back in Pisces and redo this with you or fix this with you. But I don't know where you stand and how you feel about the situation. Let's go back to their energy now. So they have the six of wands, nine of coins. How do they feel now? The ace of cups the star card and the nine of swords they're worrying about this connection they're worried that they can't get you back that everything they did or said it's too little too late like you are blocking this connection with the seven of wands how else do they feel about pisces how else do they feel about pisces we have the justice card like you got justice you walked away page of coin the Wheel of Fortune and the Eight of Cups. Yeah, you know what's interesting is to me in this deck, the Page of Queen, he looks so sad. Like he did something wrong and he wants forgiveness. But this is how this person I think is feeling. They are showing him as the King of Coins. So someone had, Libra had similar energy. I think there was another sign. I don't know, maybe it was just theirs. But mm -mm. they know that you got justice by leaving this. But you walked away and... You did what needed to be done. So they're going to try to get you back, Pisces. Okay. What is the King of Cups energy? Three of Swords. 
Six of Swords and the Two of Coins. I feel like this person really doesn't know what to do now. Five of Coins, end of the deck. I feel like they just like they do they try to get you back now? Do they let it go? I feel like they're obsessing about this energy. What was right here? This is no this Knight of Swords. Yeah, this is wanting to go quickly, coming after you, wanting to tell you how they feel. So tell us something about this connection, universe. What does Pisces need to know about this connection? Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. All right. Tell us something else about this person that we may not know at this time, how they're feeling or what they're doing. This person is in love with you. Interesting. So now they realize they've lost you. Now they're worried about this. Okay, what are they going to do? What actions are they going to take? Let's go to the Magician. Let me go to a different deck, though. Let me go to this deck. Can you show me actions that they're going to take toward Pisces? What are the actions they're going to take? Justice. They're coming as the King of Wands. Nine of Swords. Worrying about this. Thinking things through. Hermiting. So they have done some reflection. They have done some thinking. I do see some soul searching. When will they come toward Pisces? Can you tell us maybe when they will come towards Pisces or communicate with Pisces? Ace of Swords, so very soon. So you have the Ace of Swords twice here and also the Sword and the Rose. So definitely something will come out, some type of um, communication. Uh, they'll, they're going to say something. It will vary. I have the Six of Swords under the deck. could be within six days. How does this person view Pisces? I mean, they're definitely seeing you walk away. Definitely sad. What was your initial energy? Was that Eight of Cups? It was, wasn't it? Yeah. Judgment, Queen of Swords, the Fool, and the Page. This person is definitely keeping an eye on you. I feel like they see you very differently with this Queen of Swords energy now. You're not somebody to, to be messed with. Page of Coin, again, under the deck. Or I split the deck, three of swords, they're feeling sad about the situation. I feel like for some of you, you will not take this person back or you will be very hesitant. Uh, there could be, I'm sorry about that, I need to bump it. That was, could be an Aquarius involved. They may be seeing you have a good time, nine of cups, a wish fulfilled. Some of you may be collaborating with somebody else. You may not know about this yet. The moon tells me something could be hidden here. Um, but some of you may have a wish fulfilled coming in here in the new moon. That is tomorrow night going to Wednesday. Also, I'm getting something to do with Aquarius season because of the star card. So what is this? What is this moon energy? Page of coin communication manifesting. Wow. This person just keeps popping up everywhere. I mean, the moon is your energy course, Pisces. You might be dealing with another Pisces, but I just feel like this person is going to be an emotional wreck. They may have their moon in Aquarius also. Because I keep, this page's coin just keeps showing up. So, I mean, they could be an earth sign. So they could be messaging you a lot or texting you coming up here. It could be to where you don't, you know, you may want to block them for some of you, depending on how you feel about this person. They're going to come in with... They're going to try to show emotion. They're going to try to be romantic. They're going to try to fix this with you. Um, you know what I feel like? I feel like every time I pull cards for you, I feel like this person pops up. I mean, this reading is about them. There is a lot of passion, but it's kind of like they don't. It's like I want to maybe channel other messages, right? I want to see what else is going on for you, Pisces. Uh, maybe work or family or other things. But I feel like I just keep pulling cards with this person saying, no, no, don't. Don't take your eyes off me. Like, don't forget about me. What about me is what I'm kind of getting from this person. It's like they're doing things. I don't know. I don't know if they would do spell work or any, you know, light candles or anything like that. I don't know how many people do that. But it almost feels like this person may go to great lengths to try to win you back. They may even try to, uh, I'm getting like write um, a letter or a poem or something, like write it out by hand actually. Maybe put like a, a note or a rose or something on your car. Um buy you something that you they know that you really like or you need is what i'm getting what else trying to put their best foot forward is what they said temperance but you might give them the cold shoulder yeah it's like you need time to think seven of wands the emperor um it's like 
you may not trust them at this point, Seven of Wands, Emperor Energy. Uh, you need time to think things through, to read what they're writing, to think it, think about it yourself. I feel like you're not ready to jump back in this relationship because of what has happened in the past, but I feel like this person wants a genuine new... Let's see where it would go, though. Okay, now this may not be good, but we're going to see where this might end up. Can you tell us if Pisces were to reconcile with this person, where it would go? I do see temperance, ten of coins. I will show you that. Where could this go in the future for Pisces and this person? Listening to your intuition, the star card. There is hope here, the knight of cups. Seven of cups, the seven of swords, the five of coins, the ace of swords, and the emperor energy again. This person right now, this is kind of, this could be in the future, but let me read it in a more positive light. And then they are hoping to win you back. This person has done some things that are probably were deceptive and they have left themselves out in the cold. They do want to come back in. They are coming back as emperor with the ace of swords again. The ace of swords has shown up in every single deck. They want this reunion with you. So... They are missing you. They are lonely. Four of Swords wants to come out, so I'm going to let it come out. It tells me that you need to think, because Hierophant and Six of Coin, was there breadcrumbing? Is this worth, worth it? What else, though, can you show us? Will this go back to the way it was? What will this person do? Eight of Coin, working on it. Two of Coins, the Page of Swords, and the Four of Coins. There is potential here. There is. I do have the Eight of Cups under here. So again, somebody may walk away to new love. You have the Ace of Cups here and the Four of Wands. So you do have potential new love coming in within the next four months. Um, this person, again, might be very possessive of you. When I get like the Page of Swords and this kind of energy of the future, it tells me that someone may be spying on the other person. It could be you. Yes, you may be checking up on them. But again, if they're a jealous person, they could be checking up on you, especially maybe if there's other people at work. Um, this person will work on it initially, but again, I think that they will find other things that will interfere in the relationship. With, like, they have a lot to juggle. They may say, oh, I work a lot. I, I don't have time for this or that. And I feel like they could hold back affection with the Four of Coins. Um, I feel like... On the other hand, the Ace of Cups, the Four of Wands, there is love here. This could be rebuilt, but the Four of Coins, maybe one, one more for the Four of Coins. The fool's in reverse. Am I holding my deck upside down? I am. I do read reversals, but I am holding the whole thing upside down. So let me flip it around. The fool, the knight of wands, and the seven of coins. This person's stubborn. If, if I do read these in reverse, there is... Um, they could be letting go of their old ways in some, some sense. If they were a player... But at the same time, that's, still, that's kind of a stubborn energy with the Four of Coins is what I'm getting with this particular person. I feel like for some of you, this would revert back to the way it was. Um, I feel like this person could go back to some of the old ways. You may not be happy with this person, but at the same time, I feel like for another group of you, are the Hierophant, Eight of Swords, the Tower... Three of Wands, the Six of Swords, Ten of Cups, and the Two of Cups. For some of you viewing this, this has been a wake-up call for this person with the Tower. Seeing you walk away, seeing you leave, take control of this has definitely changed this person, has definitely caused them Tower energy. You know, they have been like a shook, they've been woken up. I'm not saying this is not unrepairable, because for some of you, I feel like this could be repaired. It's totally up to you. Where are you at? Do you want to come back? Do you want to work on this? Or are you done for good? Because I do see there's a love between the two of you. And I do see for some of you, definitely, this could definitely go to a better phase. As long as this person and you could be, you know, uh, looks at the past and looks at what's, what has happened. And doesn't take you for granted. Because sometimes that love can wear off and then people go back. But yeah, I'm saying for some of you, this could definitely work. So, all right, Pisces, I'm going to leave it there. Have a great week, you guys, and I'll talk to you soon.